What's going on guys? Your boy Micah here coming at you. And yesterday, I lost my watch. But today, I found it. Okay, I'm super excited because I wanna show you guys something. I did this last weekend and it's the second time doing this, but it was super fun. Now what is it, you may ask? I stayed in a tiny house. Now I live in Houston, Texas, but I searched because Airbnb is a fantastic tool and why not do a staycation? I was like, yes, I think that would be super cool. So I did a quick search, logged onto Airbnb, and guess what I found? A tiny house. Now I stayed in one previous too. It was actually built, built from the ground up like a tiny house. That was in Northern California when I went on a family vacation with my fam. So you turned 60 this month. How you feeling? Feeling pretty good, actually. He just climbed this way up here. All the way out of here. That's nice, man. That was awesome. I loved that vacation. God, I miss those days. Anyways, let's get back to it. This is a converted storage unit. Check it out. All right, I made it with a margarita. All right guys, Fusion Tacos in Houston, Texas off Airline and North Main Street. If you are in this area, check it out. All right guys, check it out. So I got the HK Donut, Ooh. which HK stands for Hong Kong, not sure why, but it's a blend that tastes like cinnamon toast crunch. Also got a house iced tea with lemon. Let's give this a try. This is absolutely divine. Mm. I want to savor each bite, but I don't at the same time. Mm. Now I'm going to get some ice cream at Fat Cat Creamery. So do you guys eat your floats with a spoon? Or with a straw and let it all melt. Either way is good to me. <laughs> What's going on, guys? Micah here coming at you, and this is my crib for the weekend. Let's go take a tour. All right, guys, let's check out the crib. So, what we got first? Bathroom. So as I got here, I had a welcome note, which is very nice. And chalk's like a blackboard, so I thought that was really cool. And I guess this is sort of like a barn door. I don't know, whatever, however that works, it's really cool. Come on in, let's check out the bathroom. We got an upright washer and dryer, which is very cool. Kind of loud actually, but it's all right. Toilet, shower, which is pretty cool. It's got a little curtain, but it's not, it's actually kind of hard to get in here. Oh, so if you're old, this ain't your scene, man. This ain't your scene. And that's basically it. Let's head on out to the kitchen, the cocina. Uh, dishwasher, tons of space, which is actually cool because a lot of Airbnb, Airbnbs don't provide adequate dishes. Like they'll give you one crappy little spatula. So this place really provided quite a bit of stuff to uh, get things done. Dog treats, wolf, 
for the two dogs, which are very cool. Hopefully we can get a uh, glimpse of them. Stove, oven, coffee maker, microwave, upright refrigerator, which does not have a ton of room, but it's ideal for the amount of space and the amount of people that will be staying here, which is small. Um, dining room table, all my junk. Come over here to the bedroom. This is the nook. I'm chilling with the nook. So it's inside interior. This is the storage unit and they built it in addition to that. Queen size bed is full. Really nice. Then we have a little console, the television, which they hooked it up with Netflix, Amazon, all that good stuff. Then we got the futon. This is not comfortable at all. So I would not sleep on that. All right guys. So that ends the tour. This is basically a converted shipping container. Yeah, the big ones that you see on the cargo boats. That's all it is. They converted it, put some additions on it, and made it real home-like. So anyways, that's the tour, guys. All right, guys. I just hit bleh, about three hours of editing, which, oh, man. I did get up every hour, though, for at least five minutes, and I stretch a little bit, right? Um, it's super important because, man, I tell you what, your back will just start cramping. At least mine does, you know, because your abdominals shut off when you sit. It's a very bad position. There's no good way to sit, honestly. Um, unless you manspread. <laughs> yeah, it can be a bit uncomfortable for others. Anyways, it puts your hips in a better position. So, less strain on the back. But yeah, that's it, guys. That concludes today's vlog. I hope you enjoyed today's content, honestly. It's Thursday, which means Throwback Thursday, so I showed some content from way back in the day, actually almost a year ago, and the tiny house that I just stayed in was uh, this past weekend. So, yeah, if you have an opportunity, go stay in a tiny house. Just rent it and just go try it out, you know? Why not? That's what life's about, just getting out there and trying things because you really don't know how much time you have left on this planet. So, get out there. Start living. As usual, thank you guys for tuning in. And if you are new to the channel, welcome. If you enjoyed today's content, go and hit that little thumbs up. If you'd like to see more content like this and see where this vlog goes over the course of 365, yes, one year, go and hit that little subscribe button. Other than that, guys, keep learning, growing, and moving.